journey began with a passion and an idea to create a product. It all started with the love of wine. Wine became part of my life. Always seeking more knowledge about the origins, the way it's made. Add to this the health benefit that wine offers. It became the drink that I appreciated the most. I became a collector of fine wine for personal consumption. This interest in wine became more in-depth when I started reading more uh, into the subject and seeking more knowledge from academic uh, sources. When I uh, got married to my wife, Kathy, she became interested as much as I did, as much as I was, in wine. And this mission continued on to become more of a family interest winemaking and every individual in the family uh, had similar passion, some more than others. Thirty acres have been planted with vines, uh, 35,000 total, uh, of varieties of Cabernet Sauvignon, Syrah, Cabernet Franc, Merlot, some Sauvignon Blanc, Muscat, Riesling, and Chardonnay. Throughout the uh, district of Batroun in six different towns from different elevations, 250 meters above sea level up to 1,450 meters. Our farming practices are the traditional method of taking care of the land and keeping our land free of chemicals. We uh, use only organic fertilizer and we spray only organic sprays and no weed killer. All the weeds are suppressed manually either by plowing uh, with a tractor or with a hoe to control the area right below the vines. winter time and it's time to give our new vine uh, for the new season give it the new look to start the new spring growth here this is another this is a vine that gave us the uh, grapes of last year just how it looks like now we're gonna give it the new look to start the new season here's one arm here's another arm or even this one those two arms can bear the next season so we, we leave one bud next to it. This is the arm. This is another one that we will cut and leave one bud that will give us the next, the next shoot that will carry the next year arm. These two arms are tied to this bottom wire. And the shoots that grow from these buds here at every one will grow vertically and most of them will either tie onto those two wires or even grow, be grow between the two wires. And, it, and the shoots keep growing and will attach on the top wire. All these trimmings are shredded back into the ground using an automatic shredder. These are the shreddings that we obtain by shredding the trimmings from this season and then we till it back into the ground we plow it with the tractor back into the ground to feed the microbiology of the soil. So this is how it looks like after one season. And this coming up season will have a new fresh shredding. Quality wine is made in the field and not in the winery. Uh, we spend about 80% of our time taking care of our vines throughout the year. became a family mission. A family mission where every individual in our family uh, became part of the project. Mm -hmm. 
We are today in, in, in Angula Field. This is one of the six towns that we plant vines. Uh, this is a very unique uh, spot, very unique fields. It's uh, at the 950 meter altitude. A major contributor to the quality of the grapes are the soil, the altitude, the grape variety, and the trimming of the vine and how they were managed throughout the growing season. We aim at uh, making wine that are as natural as can be. Uh, we take care of our land as, uh, as gentle to the environment as possible. The grapes that we uh, receive here uh, uh, are optimum in quality uh, from color to tannin uh, and to the aroma the complexity. We believe this is, uh, this is probably an ideal location, ideal, ideal orientation, and it's a perfect soil. <laughs> Grapes rely on the seasonal rain and the water contact in the soil, no irrigation. This way we can obtain the concentrated grapes that will transfer into a concentrated full body wine. The journey began 10 years ago, pretty much, and it's an on the right track. Let's hope uh, we keep the momentum and keep everybody involved in the family who everyone helps in their own way. Everyone in life has a dream, and our dream at Betro Mountains is to establish the field, establish the winery, and the brand recognition and make the wine that we can be proud of. This mission we have started. My wife and I are working toward accomplishing that dream together.